Pedal Magazine. We're here at the 2014 World Championships Men's Elite with Derek Zanstra, who just came in and very impressive 15th. Derek, congratulations first. Uh, tell us about your ride. What were you looking for? It was a bit of a slow start. Uh, didn't have the best. I got a little tangled up, and uh, after the first minute, I was kind of like, "Oh, I don't know. My legs aren't feeling that good." And then all of a sudden, they just kind of kicked in, and I got in that momentum of just like going hard all the time and trying to just pass as many people in NASCAR run by, kind of be aggressive um, out there, and uh, and it paid off. At the end. It, it showed that you were moving up quite a bit in the first few laps too. Yeah, never settle in, as my teammate told me. Good one. Uh, the, the uphills were were hard. Um, for you, what was the most challenging part? Uh, trying to uh, stay away from uh, punctures and stuff like that. It's a really rocky course, a lot of shield mm -hmm. rock, sharp. And uh, leading into this race, we had you know, a fair bit of incidents. And uh, so we were just kind of 90% on the downhills to just kind of keep things, uh, keep things going. So. Mm -hmm. You were in the top, uh, you were even before 15th or so, you were riding really well, you, um, you picked a lot of guys apart, you stayed around on your own, um, you had your own plan going on for a while. Yeah, I tried to, like, it's always nice if we came to the start finish behind someone and you'd be able to draft. Um, uh, I was, I think I was in 13th uh, around there, I was right behind Fabian and Ralph Naft, they were mm -hmm. together and uh, we were just kind of like right on the mid, so I just caught those guys and uh, so I was kind of hoping to push on the downhill and uh, yeah, and, you know, stuff happens, but you know, I, I managed to survive and get through it and uh, push hard for the last lap, so. This is your best showing at the Worlds. Yeah, yeah, I think uh, last year, last year I had a crash right at the start of the race, I was over the bars before I even knew what happened, mm -hmm. and uh, it was DFL right off the uh, start, so uh, this race went better than that, and uh, you know, I tried to stay out of trouble, and uh, maybe, you know, like, bike on the upright. And, uh, you feel you're in your best form? Yeah, it's been coming together really well, like the last uh, three weeks ago, Jeff and I had a really good ride in Wyndham, and even St. Anne went pretty well, and you know, every race I just kind of move up, and they kind of start to learn where I belong out there, and uh, it's really nice to know that, and know what I have to do to be up there as well. Yeah, reflecting on 214, how would you put this? Oh, it was a great end of the season, I'm pretty excited, uh, you know, life's good for me, I'm getting married in four weeks. And, oh, congratulations. Uh, yeah, we go from here to Vegas, and uh, it's supposed to be a pretty big party there for me, so I'm kind of a little bit nervous about that, my team's pretty aggressive, so <laughs> we'll see what happens, happens there, but it's, a, it's all fun games for now. Sounds like a good way to start your off season. Yeah. Congratulations yeah. on both counts. Thanks. We still got racing left. We still got Iceman coming and some other uh, local races. Uh, I'm doing, uh, you know, some riding with uh, like Crank the Shield next weekend on uh, Saturday, Sunday. We'll ride with some uh, some other riders here. Just kind of pull them along, I guess, and have some fun. So that'll be good as well. Right on. Congratulations. Yay. Take care.